Hey, this is Paul Booth and you are watching Loudwire. I was at a convention in New Jersey and tattooing and he was staying at the same hotel for a, a, a fight. I guess he was a fan, he heard I was there. So uh, he came up to the booth and, and uh, asked about getting tattooed. So I ended up tattooing him in the hotel room so no one would bother him. Um, and uh, so we worked privately up there during the convention. That was the first time I believe I met him. Very quiet guy, you know, very in character. Quiet and big, menacing guy, you know. He had to duck and turn sideways to walk in the hotel room. I remember that. I'm like, holy crap, this guy's huge. I tattooed his bicep. and. Uh, uh, the demon I drew on him was inspired by him because the way he would come in to his victim, you know, and he had that kind of thing going on. So I did this tattoo of a, a demon kind of lurching forward and uh, not him, but inspired by him. And uh, I remember his arm was so huge, it was like doing a back piece. I couldn't even wrap my hand around it. It was, you know, it was like this. He just sat down and he just... didn't move you know and uh, I you know I, and I of course I asked the question like is that shit real or what you know and and, and, and you know it's you know theatrical and everything and he's like uh, I'm a hurting mother man you know he's like broken bones and bruises and you know even though it's like staged you still got like a 300 pound dude falling from like eight feet high and landing on it, you know. So yeah, they get hurt, you know. But I had to hear from the horse's mouth because some of it's so over the top, you know. He's a quiet guy like Kerry, uh, you know. Uh, uh, Undertaker's a guy that really only speaks when he has something to say, uh, as I remember it, you know. Uh, but I mean, we've had great conversations. Uh, very polite guy, very uh, serious guy, but, um, you know, very friendly. Uh, you could see him being the Undertaker in real life, you know. He went, yeah, that's the Undertaker. He still has that vibe. I mean, it's very genuine.